réalises. Ah. Faut que tu réalises. We are the best kept secret. The ah. Regarde autour de toi. Ouvre les yeux. Isha means to reveal, you know? Right. So we're revealing what is written. This is Revelation chapter 1, starting at verse 13. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man. But she won't, she won't actually go, but what's also, yeah? You, you learn to read the, the King James Version. Okay. Got so the King James Version, yeah. No, 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 you don't need me to go to, you don't need to do that. Go to, uh, no, I have it yeah, there all the time. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, that's the one. Okay, don't worry, just go to, uh, go and find it. Go to uh, Revelation 1. And I don't, what, 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 uh, what version is that? Oh, here you go, let me get it. Okay, okay, Revelation yeah, yeah, yeah. chapter 1, verse 1. Mm -hmm. The revelation of Yahweh Shai HaMashiach, which the world calls him Jesus Christ. Right. right. His real name is Yahweh Shai HaMashiach, which the Most High gave unto him to show unto his servants things which must shortly come to pass. You see 13, it says, and in the midst of the seven candlesticks, you know the seven candlesticks, the menorah right here? Yeah, yeah. It says, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot. Right, clothed with a garment down to the foot, that's why you're wearing a garment. Are they be dirty? Oh shit, I need to <laughs> sew it out, man. My life, clothed with a garment carrier. down to the foot, and got about the pass with a golden girdle. A golden girdle is like a belt, like an ancient um, time belt that they used to wear. Yeah. It says, his head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow, and his yeah, eyes so were that the one, of fire. If you look, uh, the holy, the only people that have the holy texture, as far as the people is who? Which, out of the so-called white people, out of the so-called Arab, Arab people, Chinese. out of the so-called Chinese people, out of the so-called black people, who has the most holy hair? It's us. So when he say his hair was white, it means that, you know, some of our people, when they get to a certain age, what happened? It become gray. Yes. That's what it's describing. Okay. All right. And sometimes when you're too stressed as well, yeah. you, you, go, you get gray. Or when, you're, when your hair texture is too good, by the time you're 30, 35, you have some gray. Some yeah. people that are 30, 35, that have gray, yeah. you know, whitish gray type of, you yeah. know, hair texture, yeah. right? Yeah. That's what he's talking about. So that's the, that's the, descri the description of the one that the ignorant call, igno ignorant, ignorant called, Jesus. called Jesus, but actually his name is Yahweh Shai. Because when you go to Matthew 1 21, he says what? He will come and save his people. His name will be Jesus. He will come and save his people. But actually, his name is into his mission. So his name is Yahweh Shai, which means he delivers. Because he, he come to deliver a certain people. All right, carry on, man, so we don't go off And the, his feet up. like onto fine brass, you as see, if they burned in furnace. And his feet is all, it's like fine, with brass, what color is brass, honey? Rice, it's white. Brass, brass. Sorry, brass. Brass, brass. What brass. color is brass? Brass is like a... You know, like a 2P coin. What color is a 2P coin? Or one p What color is a 2P coin? You know the 2P, the 1P, I don't have it, but... It's a silver, right? No, 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 no. That's 10P. 1P. 1P, you know the, this country. Mm -hmm. The 1P and the 2P coin, what color is it? Brown stuff. Brown, yes. yeah. So that's the color, copper. copper. But you see, as if they put it into the furnace. Do you know I mean, if you put something in the furnace, it becomes what? Dark. Yeah, yeah. So, when I was Jesus, he was dark brown. Yeah. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So, yeah. this is it again. And we can show you again if you go to Daniel. Go to Daniel 7. And we will show you the appearance of the Creator. It's all in the Bible. But they're not going to tell you that because that, that's not the. That's not a plan, you know, to tell you who you are and that you will be the same blood as Jesus. Imagine that. Imagine if they told you that you're the same blood as Jesus. What's going to happen is that you are going to have more, you know, um, high self-esteem. Here's the book of Daniel, chapter see? 7, verse 9. I beheld till the thrones were cast down. See that? Uh -huh. And the ancient of days. And the see. ancient of days. So the ancient of days is the Father, the Creator. He's the one that created all things. That's, that's the ancient of days, carry on my life. Whose garment was white as snow. Whose garment was white? So he's wearing garment as well. This is our culture, but it was white. 
okay. and the hair of his head and if the garment white means purity because our father is holy carry him and the hair of his head like the pure wool you see that yeah. same thing like his son yeah. so his son jesus yahweh shai has that sort of things also our hair and his daddy his daddy has the same thing like i said we were created you know in in his image all right yeah so we that we are the children of the most high yeah. and we are created in his image yeah. okay carry on his throne was like the fury flame yeah and his wheels as burning fire but, that, but that's it right there you know that's it so that's the that's what's going on this is what we're teaching our people that's one thing to tell us who we are because they lied to us by giving us the white jesus image they lied to us that's one now second well i go to uh uh first timothy four and four First Timothy 4 and 4, because first Timothy 4 and 4, this is how our people, this is how our people will lie to as far as what you can eat and what you cannot eat. So if I ask you, do you eat pork? Exactly. Why do you eat pork? Because it's such meat. Yeah, but you see, but you see, we're not supposed to. We're acting from the beginning. Yeah, we don't eat. We don't eat. You know why? You know why? I see, that's the spirit. The Bible says in Romans 8 and, and, and 16 that the spirit bear witness to our spirit that we are the children of the Most High. So, and also, uh, uh, Romans 2 and 14. Let me read it quickly before you read that one. Romans 2 and 14 says this. Yeah, get it quickly. Get it quickly. Romans. You know, because this is something that's powerful, man. That's our culture. In our culture, we where, where I'm from, you know, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't eat them thing, man. No, we don't. It's the book of Romans, <laughs> chapter two, starting at verse fourteen, and it reads, "For when the Gentiles, yeah, which have not the law, you see that, do so by nature the Gentiles, the meaning a Gentile, there's two sort of Gentile. You got the first Gentile, which is the, the non-Israel mm -hmm. Israelite. Yeah. You got the second Gentile, which." is a gentile that lost like us we were gentile even you up to this day you had a gentile mercy because you didn't even know that you're an israelite no. you were living like that but you didn't even know that the book was your book yeah. you didn't know that jesus looked like you and god looked like you, you didn't know that. for you were gentile as far as your mentality so what does he say for when the gentiles which have not the law do by nature the things contained in the law so we do by nature the thing contained in the law we don't eat pork but we don't even know why we don't eat pork. That's because we are the people of the book. Because back in time, our fathers and our mothers and our people knew the laws. But after the, the, the slavery and after colonization, we lost our identity, our ways. So now go back to the the the, the first Timothy four and um, four. Read it. First Timothy chapter four, verse four. Right. Bring that out. For every creature of the Most High is good. That? For every creature of the Most High is good, right? Yeah. So that's what he's telling me. Like, you know what? Every creature of the of the Most High is good. So I'm gonna eat the pork. But the thing is, the reason why he say every creature a creature of whatever what did you say? Read it again. every most creature high. of the most high is the good. reason why i say every creature of the most high is good is because, because the pork so though what, not what eatable mm -hmm. because it's unclean what does the pork do the pork is a sanitary agent yes he cleans the earth yeah. if you go into water the prone cleaning the water so that's why he say that so that he said what did you say again for every creature of the most high so that's, is good that's why he said that every the pork is good the prone is good, yeah. carry on. And nothing to be refused. Right, so that means a bad, a bad, a bad, a false balance, okay, is an abomination to the most high, meaning everything is balanced. You've got day and you've got night. You've got good and you've got bad. You've got animals that are clean and animals that are unclean. Right? So that's what he's talking about. Carry on. If it be received with thanksgiving, right? For it is sanctified by the word of the most. So that means, but then when they see that, that's, this is what they say. They say that, oh, we can eat everything. But that's not so. No. Because, try and go, let me see. Go to um, Job, Job of 4 and 14 or 14. Yeah, sorry, the question. Last night I had a dream. Really, yes. I was passing by. What? Three guys stopped me in my dream. And then, here? No, no, no. I'm not from here actually. Okay. And I came here yesterday. But three guys stopped me and one looked like you. What? Yes. And 
This is This is deep. Just looking at you. This is something. Oh. Yeah, I to say something to me. I was like, I'm thinking, you know. I just tap me. I said, okay, let me just tap there and, and then listen to what they are saying, you know. Three. What? Yeah. Wow. What? So God is trying to tell me. Job 14 and 4. Job. Oh, yeah, but that's what happened. Manifestation right there. Yeah. Manifestation right there, man. You see? Job chapter 14, verse 4. Job chapter 14, verse 4. Who can bring a clean thing out of an unclean, not one? So you say, who can bring a clean thing out of an unclean thing, not one? So you cannot, by your prayer, yeah. make the part that was declared unclean. to be unclean clean. clean. Go to um, Leviticus uh, 11. Let's start verse 24. We're going to show this. The most I classify things, you know. The pastor are not teaching us, man. No, not at all. These pastors are actually destroying us because when the most I come, we, we, we're going to read the Bible. You're going to hear, we're going to see, man. We're going to read the Bible, man. We're going to read this Bible. You're going to understand what's coming. Because you got to know what's coming. Yeah, 24. Chapter 11, verse 24. Read. And, who, and for these ye shall be unclean. You see that? And for these ye shall be unclean, carry on. Whosoever toucheth the carcasses of them mm -hmm. shall be unclean until the evening. You see that? So there's certain things, and when you read it from the top, then read it, finish it, and then we're going to go back to our And reverse. whosoever beareth aught of their cast, right, of them shall wash his clothes and be unclean until the evening. Carry on. The carcasses of every beast mm -hmm. which divideth the hoof mm -hmm. and is not cloven footed, mm -hmm. nor cheweth the cloth. So you, you see, you see the, the, the pork, yeah? He go uh, divide the hoof, but what happened with this? Like he doesn't chew the the cord. Many, you know, you know, the, you know, you know, in Africa, when you see the sheep and the goats, what do they do? When they eat the the, 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 grass, the grass, yes. you go back and they bring it back again. Yeah. And they and chew they the cord. Yeah? yeah. That's it. These are the clean animals. So you can eat goat, you can eat lamb, you can eat a uh, uh, cow, all of these things. But you can't. You can't eat. Uh, 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 the rodent, you know the bush meat. Yeah. Bush meat, antelope. You can eat antelope, but you can't eat bush meat. Bush meat is the is the. And this is the reason why they fall sick. And we're going to, we're going to show you that. When you finish that, actually, when you finish that, go to Deuteronomy 28. We're going to show you why our people are sick, man. There's no clothing. Food. It's not true of the cut are unclean unto you. See that? Everyone that toucheth them shall be unclean. You see that? Everyone that touches them shall be unclean. Meaning, if you eat them. You will be unclean. You see? What's going on? What? Huh? You don't eat meat yet, but you're, you're fine because even the Bible say that. We come. No, 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 no. No, we can eat meat. So the Bible, do you believe in the Bible? You don't believe in the Bible. Why you don't believe in the Bible, my brother? Come, come, come. Close your fire then, come. Yes. Say that again? I don't believe in the Bible. Why don't you believe in the Bible? So I don't tamper with it. They tamper with it, but you see this Bible. Everything that is going on right now. Go to Revelation 13. I will show you something. Now you say the Bible is tampered. But the thing is, why is every history actually go to Deuteronomy 28 to 68 where, where you from I brother? Say, what you heard in it is true but like I say you have to know say you have to pick out the spirit that's why like I say if you try to read the Bible it's like a farm and like you turn nuts up no you, you can't read the Bible like you read a book okay, all right take care mommy yeah Thank take you care so yeah much. yes what's your name mommy Jenny Jenny yes. you see the dream that you had that's the most I calling you See that channel? Go and look it up. See if you got a question, just give um, a comment, ask the question, I will answer. Take it seriously. Don't be, but there will be a lot of uh, national things and a lot of a lot of trying, man, when the time comes. Do not miss the opportunity. This is serious business. Okay? So, Jenny, take care. Now, back to my brother. Yeah? We gotta give it all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Waha, Raka, Badash. All right, double honors to the to the apostle of GMS. Okay, we teach you real well. Double honor to the brother Ashan and the church of Yahweh Shai. Peace and salutation. All right, to the brothers who are doing the work all around the globe. Shalom, one more half to the brothers and the sisters who are awaiting the return of our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai Amashiach. All right, so now.
Don't you do wrong with me? Because you say something that's true. Yes, the Bible was tampered with. But you got to understand, this is the book of life. So no matter what our enemy did to destroy this book, they weren't able to. Why? How do we know that the Bible is the best book on earth? Because everything that happened on this God-given earth was written in the Bible. And I'm going to give you one account. Go to Deuteronomy 28 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. See, and the Lord shall bring you into Egypt again in sheep. Now, when you read, you say to yourself, when you read the Bible, yeah? The Bible is not a book like you read like a, like a, like a, like a book. This is a very spiritual thing where you have to yeah, study you have it. To study, yeah. So Egypt means bondage. All right? Now, if you know history, if those who went to, 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 to Egypt... But if you notice, what they're trying to do, I have to Egypt from Africa. Right, but the, right, 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 exactly, exactly. And the thing about it is this. Egypt, that's the spirit, because Egypt, ancient Egypt, was inhab inhabited by black people, by, by black right. people, the, do, the, the children of Ham. You see? But at the same time, at some point, we were slaves in Egypt because at that time, Egypt was ruling. Just like America and England are ruling today, Egypt was ruling at that time and we were slaves. Just like if you go into the wall of certain pyramids in, 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 in Egypt, you will, see, you will see our people there, slaving, just like we're slaving today. So that prophecy said, read it again. And the Lord shall bring you into Egypt again. And the Lord shall bring you into Egypt again. So that means you will go into bondage again in sheep. Now, if you know, let's go back to history now. But sometimes you know, have to know what type of lot and that in the No, 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 but I'm, 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 we, we, we got this. We got, we understand what's going on. That's why we're out here. We study this, you know? Yes, we're the, we're the selected one. We study this. So the, the, my question is this, yeah? So when he said we should go back again, right, to Egypt, and I told you that Egypt is bondage, so what you got to understand is this. Where, where, where have the people, the children of Israel, what, what people do you know were sent by sheep from one place to another place to become to, 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 to become a slave? Right, so carry on. Carry on, really. By the way whereof I stick unto thee, mm -hmm. thou shalt see it no more again. Right, carry on. And there you shall be sold unto your enemy. And there you shall be sold unto your enemy. And that's what happened. They went to America, they went to the Caribbean, okay? You understand that? For really? born men and born women. See? For born men and born women. How people were slaves, man. They and were no slaves. Man shall buy you. And no man when he said no man shall buy you, how can he say you go and be sold for slaves and uh, born men and born women? And then at the end we say no for people, no man shall no man shall buy you. Buy you here mean redeem. I'll give you one example. Marcus Gavi tried to redeem the people then. What happened to him? Martin Luther King tried to redeem the people then. What happened to them? Malcolm X tried to redeem his people. What happened to him? Bob Marley tried to raise the consciousness of the people then. What happened to him? They gave him cancer. That's what I'm saying. Now let's go to the next one. There's a priest that says, um, I will not meet you as a man. Oh, uh, that's uh, Isaiah 57. Isaiah 57. Right, so we have to wake up. Okay, we have to wake up. This book is our book. When people say, oh, no, you know, uh, 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 just, just move it. Yeah, that's it. Don't worry. No, no, no. It's this camera in it. Just leave. Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good, because you move a bit in. Look, when people say, you know, oh, this book I've been read by the, I've been, I've been written by the, by the, by the white man, you must be out of your goddamn mind. This book condemned the white man. So -called white. This book condemned the so-called white man. Because not, not everyone that you see that look like the white man is, a, is actually because how people are within them, you know. You got, you got some people that look like them, but there are people, you know. Because our people mingle with so many race and things like that. I'll give you an example. Like, let's say, for instance, you had like, you know, a child with, you know, one of them, yeah. Your son will still be one of us, even though it looks a bit like them. You get right. what I'm saying? I don't want nothing else. Huh? No, they're not dark. They're not, obviously no, I mean the data. If I'm, if the data, if I'm the data, then he's a Gentile, isn't it? No, no, no. Whatever, so far, whatever child that you have is going to be Israelite. Yeah. You know? Yeah, if you have it with them, if you're a man and you have it with them, your children are, there's no such thing as mixed, mixed race, you know? 
mixed race is a concept that was created by them because you're the one that give the if you take an apple and you bring it you if you sow an apple in jamaica an apple will come out an apple tree right the same apple if you take it you take it to japan the same thing will happen so it doesn't matter the woman is the earth all right and you are the seed so you give the seed you put it you sow the seed into the earth so you your children are you it doesn't matter who you this is isaiah Chapter 47, starting at verse 3. No, no. Thy nakedness shall be uncovered. You yeah. see that? Thy nakedness shall be uncovered. So what we're having right now with everything that's going on, if you look closely, Babylon is falling. Yeah. Thy nakedness shall yeah, be but, uncovered. No, but this one is spiritual. Yeah, I go back, but this is spiritual. The woman is Babylon, and when you say naked, nakedness in the spiritual realm, it means exposed. shame and being exposed. If you dream and you see yourself naked, you have to start, you have to wake up and start doing the right thing. Because that means spiritually you're naked. It means your enemy will be easily get you, easily get you. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's what's going on. Thy nakedness you know? shall be uncovered, yeah. yea, thy shame shall be seen. Thy shame shall be seen. Okay? I will take vengeance and I will not meet thee as a man. I will take vengeance. So, so Jesus, the one that I call Jesus, his name is not Jesus. His name is Yahweh Shai. That's what I'm trying, that's what I'm beginning from the beginning. But he just the mindset but brother, the brother, listen to this, yeah? It says that I will not meet thee as a man. Now we read in Deuteronomy 28 and 68, it says no man will redeem you. So we're going to need divine intervention for us to be redeemed. Yeah, that's powerful. You know, because you don't have a regular man that, you know, so many men have tried and they haven't bought us out of this situation that we're in. Look at us, we're living in the ghettos, in the slums. Look at how we're suffering inside the society, man. Look at how these nations are trolling on us. You know, they're treating us like shit, you know, racism, you know. Do, do you know the word ghetto means where the Jews dwell? We're all up in the ghettos, man. You know. So when the scripture says, I will not meet thee as a man, we're going to need divine intervention to be redeemed, man. No regular man is going to be able to redeem us out of this condition. Right. So what do we need to do now? Go to Deuteronomy 10. There's something that we need to do, you know. My oh, brother, as Israelite, we cannot live anyhow, you know. This is why we have sickness. This is how we have ghetto. This is where we die. Gangs, murder, drugs. How women go and have sex with other men while she with you and things like that. It's a curse. We are a curse people. Read it, my lad. Deuteronomy chapter 10 verse 1. 12. Deuteronomy chapter 10, starting at verse 12. Bring that out. And now Israel. And now Israel. What doth Yahweh thy power You see that? Of so the most I say, hey Israel, hey Jamaican, hey Nigerian, hey Ghanaian, so on and so forth. What does, what do I require from you? I require something from you. Read it. But to fear Yahweh your power. So, but to fear Yahweh. So when people say, may I fear the Lord, man. You fear the Lord, but how do you fear the Lord? It's by your action. When you say to your children you love them, you show it by your action because you provide for them, you provide a roof for them, you help them, you buy stuff for them, you, you, you protect them if anyone want to, you know, you're there, you're the guardian. And, and brother, it's well, you know, you know the cigarette too as well, it, it damages the temple. You know, the, the temple, your body is the temple. So it says, you know, that we, we're meant to keep our temple, you know, clean. So we're not meant to be smoking cigarette, you know. Yeah, that's herb, yeah. But uh, let me tell you, let me tell you some. Yeah, cigarette, yeah. Because your your body, your body is uh, your body is the temple of the Most High. So, and you find about it's like when you us, yeah, we are holy people. We are the saint. Saint are holy people. We need to separate. All these smoking tobaccos, all of those things came from the heathens, man. Now, tobacco itself, pure tobacco. No, pure pure tobacco. It's no, I don't pure, no, 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 no. Pure tobacco. Pure tobacco has healing in them. You can use tobacco. To, it's a lot. It's, you see, we lost a lot of our, even the, 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 the weed, the, the cannabis. It has some healing thing on it, but it's how you use it. And now, today. This is not the right way. It's yes. Drinking. And the, yes, you have to make tea in that. And even that one, yeah. What happened is that, you know, back in time, back in time, we used to put the cannabis into like this one. Yes. And we let it burn. So we, and then we inhale it, it makes people relax and that. But it was it was the real real one. This one is mixed. This the hybrid. Exactly. Right. It's not, it doesn't grow naturally. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't grow naturally. And that's what's going on. 
But nevertheless, you know, the most I want is to be clean. So yeah, carry on. So what did you say? Deuteronomy chapter 10, mm -hmm. starting at verse 12. Right. And now Israel, what the Yahweh, Yahweh your power require of you, mm -hmm. but to fear Yahweh your power, right. to walk in all his ways, yeah. and to love him, and serve Yahweh your power. And to love him, love with, him and serve Yahweh your power, carry on. With all your heart yeah. and with all your soul. Right, carry on. Verse 13. To Jump. keep the commandments. Yeah, to keep the commandments of, the, of the Lord yeah. and his statutes which I command you this day. So there's a law that we have to follow. The first is like we say yeah, not eating pork, all for of those things. The goods. Sabbath day. You have to keep the Sabbath day, Friday sundown to Saturday sundown, keep the Sabbath. You know, there's so many things, but you have to learn it. You have to get into to the Bible it. and yeah. practice it and learn to practice it. You see, you say practice, you have to practice, you have to rehearse it, man. You know what I'm saying? Because very soon the Mosa is coming. This is what we got coming. When I read uh, Revelation 13 and 16. This is what's coming. This is what's coming. You know, this is what's coming. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 13. Right. I'm going to start at the verse 16. Uh -huh. And it reads, and he calls it all, right. both small and great. And he calls it all, meaning the beast, you know, the beast, you know what the beast in Babylon, yeah, the people who are ruling. Right now, they're working on something where they want to control everyone. Yeah, carry on. And he calls it all, yeah. both small and great, yeah. rich and poor, rich and poor, free and born, free and born, to receive a mark, to receive a mark in their right hand, in their the right hand, and in the forehead. So, you have to understand something called the CBDC. Yeah? The CBDC, Central Bank. Uh, something currency, so digital right. currency. So now, the money, your money. Your mark, explain to me. My, my tongue is very. Yeah, so basically, um, what the brother is explaining is that they're going to bring out a cashless society where people are going to use a microchip to use the buy and sell. You know, it's called an RFID microchip. So no, no more money, debit no more. cards. Hey, very soon, I'm not cutting you over, very soon they're going to charge you to, to withdraw money, to withdraw cash. They do it right now. Right, exactly. But they, they, Yes. But it's going to be all over the place now. So, see, right now I can go to the Santander and then have my money out, no problem. But very soon, you're going to have to pay charge to discourage you from using cash so you can get into the digital one. Yeah? Wow. Hey, listen, it's getting there. It's just free, it's getting there, man. Everything I put in now. But but you have to protect yourself. Like, carry the person. Yeah, yeah. Just do your thing. I want to say you should break it down. Oh, Karen, it says Revelation 13 and 16. And he calls it all, both small and great. Right. Rich and poor, free and bond. Right. To receive a mark in their right hand or in their forehead. Right. And that no man might buy or sell, right? Save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. See that? Here so, is wisdom, right? Let him that have understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of the man, and his number is uh, six hundred three score and six. You see that? So you see how the rubber will really need my heart. So that's what's coming. The six six, right? the triple six, and they're gonna start first of all with the digital thing where the central right now. If you go to Argos. If you pay something with your card, the transaction happened between your bank and the, the banks that Argos deal with. And after a while now, it go through the bank, the, 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 the central bank, as a number. So you're not identified as such. But very soon now, they will centralize everything where they will know if you, if, let's say they want to punish you, let's say you can't, you know, shop outside of trading. If you go to Lombard, you go to, to you, you go to shop, they can stop you from shopping. You go and shop everything when you want to pay, decline. See? That's the little cheap. And it, it's, it's going on in certain countries, like uh, Sweden and that. And even in this country, you can do that. You can have it here, and then you put it in, on, on the right side, and then you, you have like, uh, you download like, uh, like the app and things like that. You see what I'm saying? So this is what's going on, man. But right now, it's the digital. The central bank 
now they can stop you from from doing shopping anywhere because they control everything and they will control if you buy fish this month if you want to buy fish again they will say no you bought enough fish for this month now it's me they will force you to eat certain thing man you know and you got this one as well making computer chip act more like brain cells No, 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 no. Yes. Yeah, so what, what happened? The, 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 the Maxine, we will say Maxine because YouTube is a bear. So we will say the Maxine, yeah, because can, we can get strike. I even got a strike as we speak. So, you know, the Maxine. No, no, no. You can't say the word basically. You then there's the a sensing thing. system. Yeah, like, on YouTube. yeah, on YouTube. You can't say certain if you things. You say certain things, they'll take down your YouTube. They will take you know, your video. And then, they'll, you know, so we have to be careful. So we're so talking about the Maxine, the juice, right? That juice was to prepare people to die. Because what happened is that there was a test to see how people were going to be obedient to the new system. You see what I'm saying? So it, it's not, it wasn't the, 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 the I-O-C-H-I-P, but he, it was the test to bring forth that, what we're talking about? A trial. A trial. So that's, that was the trial, and then this is where we're going. So things are changing. So now, Go to Revelation 3 and 10 because what's going on? You go, you, if you don't have the Mosa with you, but the Mosa is, you see, the Mosa, his name is Yahweh, it's not Jehovah, it's Yahweh. He's coming to judge the world and he's coming to judge his people. But we are the people. He will judge us first, then he will judge the world. So we have to bear in mind what's coming, man. We have to know Wagwan. Yeah? This is the book of Revelation. Read that one. Chapter 3, starting at verse 10. Mm -hmm. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience. Right. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, meaning because you kept the law, you practice it, you change your way, you, you, you got converted, you became, you know, an, an Israelite again. Yeah? Carry on. I also will keep you from the hour of temptation. I, I also will keep you from the what? From the hour of and the hours of temptation is coming. And that hour, we shall come upon all the world. We shall come upon all the world. So you know, in 2020, that was the the, the, the test, the trial for that hour of temptation. You see how the whole world was on, was on, uh, on standstill, was shut down. No one could go out. You, you were controlling this. That was just the test for the real thing. To the try hour of temptation. You see that to try them that dwell upon the earth. Now go to Ezekiel 9, 4 to 6. Because the Mosa is coming to judgment. People walking around thinking that oh it's all cool. They have dreams and they have this and that. Ambition and that goals and plan and this and that. It's not gonna be so, man. They're gonna wake up one morning and the gig's over, man. This is the book of Isaiah. The doors of mercy are closing. Chapter 9, starting at verse 4. Read it. And Yahweh said, And Yahweh said, Unto him, Unto him, Go through the midst of the city. Go through the midst of the city. Carry on. Through the midst of Jerusalem. Jerusalem is a people before a place. So we are Jerusalem, the Israelites, wherever they are in America, in the Caribbean, in Africa, in Australia, that's Jerusalem. I talk about us as a people. And set okay? a mark upon the forehead. And set a mark upon so we are right now telling people we we are marking people because the time if you got a tick you'll be protected if you got an x you're dead you're gonna read it read it set a mark upon the forehead right of the men that sigh upon and the cry. forehead of the men that sigh and cry the people that like us that that know the law that are keeping the law that are trying our best we change our ways we left babylon we left babylon alone we left it we're trying to walk, walk like, you know, hold on. We're trying to walk in, in, in the, the way, you know, where Babylon doesn't affect us. Those are the people who sigh and cry. The covenant keepers, the law keepers. The people who say, Babylon fall, Babylon shall burn. Then people then. Yes. Yes, that sign and cry for uh -huh. all the abominations that be You see that the because there's a lot of abomination. Men can go with men and all of those things. That's, you know, abomination. You know what I mean? Right. Read it. And to the obvious, he said in my hearing, right. go ye after him through the city. And go ye after him, you see? So for those who don't have the mark, if, 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 if it's not a tick on your head, 
and use your ex, you're dead because the angel will come and kill off people. Yeah. Please, eh? Let not your eyes spare, neither have pity. Let not your eyes spare. So in that time, like I said, the door of mercy right now open. People can do their thing. You have the most has, the reason why there's peace on earth. The reason why there's peace in South Norwood is because the Mosai has opened the door of mercy and the doors of mercy are not yet shut. They're not yet closed, man. But very soon, the, the door of mercy will be closed and there will be no mercy. Let me tell you something. You don't want to mess with people are scared of Satan. You should be scared of God because God created Satan. He's a terrible God, man. You understand what I'm saying? But people don't fear God, they want to fear Satan. Who is Satan? Satan just yeah, works for God. He trembles when, when the most I say, go and do one word, he run to do it. He goes to fear someone like this. Yeah. Like like yeah. Slay a three really? old and young, mm -hmm. both maids you and see that? children. So a lot of children would die. A lot of old people would die. They almost like don't care about because it gave you the time to repent. What did you do with it? You, you didn't repent? You messed it around? You, 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 you. The Bible says, haste. You know, when the, when the Mosai is coming you, you go, you can't, you can't, you can't say, oh, I'm going to wait tomorrow. No, you have to follow him immediately. Okay, read it. It says, slay utterly old and young. Yeah. Both maids and little children. Yeah. And women. Right, and women. See, God and the pastor don't tell you the money. Mommy, the, your pastor is not telling you that, that if you don't repent, you will die. Oh, you see? How people need to get what's wrong. Hello, my, hello, my brother. Old. Hello, my brother. Do you know that God is coming to kill people? <laughs> oh, that's dangerous. Slay us Man is drinking his beer, man is his, and young. in his paradise. Both men and little yeah, children. It's crazy, man. Yeah, they're lost, man. They're lost. How people are lost. You know how people perish for lack of knowledge, man. You know? And women. Yeah. But come not near any man yeah. upon whom is the mark. You see that? So, so hold on, hold on, man. Like, when you read it really slowly, you see that? So these, the people that, uh, on which the, 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 the tick was put on, yeah? No one, no one will be able to touch him. Hey, we will have spiritual power. If we power of the elect, no one will touch us in that day, you know. When you see us again, you won't, you won't, you, you, you won't. You, we, but, 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 but it's coming back again. The religion is to kill you. And divide. But if you divide, because if a, a people that hey, they have that divide, it would never prosper. So the religion is to do to, to take away your spiritual power. Well, knowing this truth will give you spiritual power. Read it, man. It says, and begin at my sanctuary. And begin at my sanctuary. Then they began at the ancient men. You see? So a lot of men, a lot of you Israel that go to go to first first yeah, Peter 4 no, and 17. I don't, I don't cut you, but like I said, you see all the things If you have the only thing to put things no, 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 but we don't care about, we don't care about them no, hearing. No, I understand what you're saying, but we just have a talk, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But when you come back the negativity, that's what they want. Oh. But it's okay, because the Bible says that in, 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 the, in, the, in the, what is the process, in the end time, people will just... Stop this. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, go, go on to that, go on to that. Take my phone. So I think your are your child is your child is your child. Right now, we stand up here. I know people look at us. It's okay. No, we know it's okay, but we don't know. It's okay. It's okay for me. You know, I really okay don't care who fit. Do I look like I'm crazy to you? No, no. What I'm trying. That's no, for what in their mindset. You not get what you're saying. But I'm asking you, do I look like I'm crazy to you? You don't crazy, but them look and But me. that's what I'm saying. But that's what I'm saying. If I don't look... Here, they have a set of mindset right, here. Right, right. And you know what it means? It means... Hold on. You know what it means? It means that this truth is not for everyone, you know? It's for a select few. Hey, the most I say, I'm going to read it. I'm going to read it. Yeah. We don't, we're not here for everyone, you know? We're here for those who are supposed to get it, man. Uh, this is 2 Corinthians. 
chapter 4 verse 3. Bring that but up. if our gospel be hid. But if our gospel be hid. It is hid to them that are lost. It is, it is hid to them that are lost. So the most is actually he hiding the knowledge for those who are lost. That's why when they walk past, they don't consider us good. We are doing a job. We call to do a job, man. But you see, let me tell you something. A, 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 um, a judge, when you go to the court, when the judge is starting to pass judgment, okay, they want to know, they want to bring all the evidence against the perpetrator, the one against the one that's the accused, right? So when the time of judgment, they can't say that they haven't heard the truth. They can't say, oh Lord, no one has warned us, no one told us that we're Israelite, no one told us to keep the Lord. They can't say that because we were in South Norwood. They went passing by after the left word, going home, and that's so me and my brother speaking about the truth, warning them, but they didn't take heed. So in that time, they will have no clock for the sin. Right? And that's what the Mosa is doing. Okay? So now. Read it. Isaiah chapter 6. And verse 9, and he said, stuck it, and he said, Go and tell these people, Hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not. Make the heart of these people fat, and make their ears heavy, and shut their eyes. You see that? Lest they see with their eyes, see that? and hear with their ears, and understand with their hearts, and convert and be healed. You see that? So, Yahweh himself, God himself, has blinded the eye of a lot of people. Now, when I read that word, 7 to, to uh, 9, even to 10. Listen to this, brother. Second Ezra, chapter 9, starting at verse 7. And every one that shall be saved, and shall be able to escape by his works, you see, by what? So you gotta keep the law, man. If you wanna be saved, you gotta do, you gotta change your ways. You can't be doing the same thing. You must have to get you. Carry on. And by faith, whereby ye have believed. You see that? Carry on. Shall be preserved from the said perils. The perils is coming, man. You can see the sign. War between uh, the Ukraine and Russia. Everyone is getting involved. There's a war that's coming, man. There's famine that's coming. There's hardship that's coming in this land, man. Fulfillment of prophecy, man. And shall see my salvation in yeah. my land. You see that? And within my borders, mm -hmm. for I have sanctified them for me from the beginning. You see that? So we are sanctified, man. You see? Us, we sent, that's what we are that doing the work of we understand it. Read it. Verse 9. Mm -hmm. Then shall they right. be in pitiful case. You see that? There's, all these people that are scoffing, these people that are not, are not listening, thinking that we're crazy, they will be in pitiful case. They will try, pity, pitiful. They will try to come and say, "Please, man, help me. I want to know if it's too late." So what we're doing right yeah, now, you know, we're gonna be doing it forever, you know. Which now have abused my ways. You see that they abuse the will of the Most High. They did what they want to do, but the Most High will get them, man. Hey. And they huh. that have cast them away despitefully shall dwell in torment you see that the destruction is coming man women men children they're all gonna die they're gonna perish because they don't want to listen okay like we said before what we see like is away from god and then you know that and then you don't change the same and stay carried out of the law of the law of the yeah, but that's because uh, that's because of the way the Musa set it up. Like I said earlier, you asked the question. We say to you that what's going on right now is written, is prophecy. <laughs> the fact that people love, you know, turn cold. People don't care anymore. They have the, they get set into Babylon. They go to work and they want to answer to Master. But when they come to their own reality or their own, you know, uh, uh, culture, they, they run away from it. All of that is set up by the Most High because He want to kill them. Because they're, they're, they're a rebellious house, man. Read it. Read it out. Romans chapter 3, verse 3. For what if some did not believe? For what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of Yahweh without effect? You see that? Just because they don't believe doesn't mean that prophecy ain't gonna come to pass, man. Prophecy is coming to pass as we speak in now. Right? So just because they don't believe, we, this is why we don't run after people. We come and do that work. 
But we know that few people, since I've been here, few people, you know, I, 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 yeah. Hey, you just, that's it. That's it. Okay. That's it, man. And that's it, man. That's it. We came for the people that are made to listen to the, to the word, man. You know what I mean? You don't. Bring it up. Yahweh forbid. Right. Yeah. Let Yahweh be true. You see that? But every man a liar. And let me tell you something. Yahweh is true, man. And very soon, these people that are going against this shoe will be found liars, man. Yeah, we'll be found. I guarantee you that all these people that I say that we're trying shit, they're going to see it that day, man. The most are going to kill them one by one. And there's nothing they can do. But the most is terrible, you know. God is a terrible power, you know. Uh, it's the fear of the most that make us come here and do the work. Because we fear him. Because we want, we, want, we, want, we want grace. We want mercy in that day. That's why we do the work of the most high, man. Because we know how terrible our power is, man. You know? Yeah, my love. So you got you got anything to bring out? Yeah, yeah. Um, nah. Yeah, man. And um, you know, people are gonna know how terrible. You know, people are gonna know how terrible the Most High is because a lot of people think that you know they're going scot free with their wickedness, man. But you know, what did the angel tell? Um, what did the angel tell John? He said, "He that is holy, let him be holy, man." Right, right, right. And right, he that right. is unjust, let him be Yeah. So still. people that wanna be wicked, let them be wicked, man. Me, I'm stopping no one from me. Yeah. Listen, and when a thief, when they do your dirt, you do your dirt, one day they're going to they're gonna catch you, man. And sometimes when you wake up that day, you don't even know that, yeah. You don't even know that you're going to get caught. And within a second, you're caught, man. So that's how life works. People, people think that they're free. See, that's what the enemy set up in his society. He want people to be serpent like him. You know, but hey, even him, he's going to pay for it. Revelation, chapter 22, and verse 11. It says, he that is unjust, let him be unjust still. You see that? He that is unjust, let, let him be unjust still, man. You see that? And he which is filthy, let him be filthy and still. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. So you can go around thinking that you're a star and do whatever you want. The most I got you, man. Hey, he got you. You can go and be a hollow. Fuck every man that is, do what you want, you can so go and I'm kill every man. Get away, really. hey. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. Right. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. That's right. Yeah. Verse 12. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me, to give every man according as his work shall be. Yeah. I am the you Alpha see that? and Omega. You see that? Your work, you're gonna pay whatever you do. The most are gonna pay. You know when you go to work, if you pull hard work, you get paid. If you do overtime, you get paid on top of it. You know what I'm saying? Everything that you do, you're gonna get your reward, man. But like, are you done with that? If you do, when you don't jump on this one, man. Jump on this from, from uh, 19 all the way to maybe uh, 26 or something So, right, chapter 19. And for, sorry, so, right, chapter 19. And verse. Uh, like, so right 23, starting at 19. Bring that out. Such a man only fears the eyes of men. Yep. And know it's not that the eyes of Yahweh mm -hmm. are 10,000 times brighter than the sun. You see that? So you got angels. And listen, as we speak, there's angels. Have you ever seen something moving in the sky? Exactly. That's the chariot. These are angels. They're talking about UFO. It's not UFO. It's the angels that are driving the engine. They're driving it. That's the, the, the little spaceship that they're driving. We it's an angel, angel man. E on it too as well if you want to bring it out. Huh? You bring the e -pod. it has like a cherry. Yeah, yeah, bring it out, bring it out. You know, um, yeah, man. Um, if I get this out real quick. Quickly, man, show them what's going on, man. Um, you know, we know, we know what's going on, man. There's two people, sure. two sets of clique who know this word. Us and the elite. You know, see that? That's the chariot, man. And the chariot, Yahweh was shy. G the one that called Jesus is coming back in this chariot. This is, this is this the fucking Chinese them are coming fucking. Yeah, but this is a uh, this is the ma a menorah. The menorah is like the seven spirit, the seven candles. Yeah, that's our culture. That's what we use. It used to be in the tabernacle in that. You know, even actually that's not even how it's supposed to be. Because when you read the Bible, they say he was in the midst of the seven 
candles. So that means was branches all around. Yeah? You have four and then all around there you got, you know, so you got seven. And then he was in the midst of it. But the way that made it, that's the that's a, a wrong a wrong uh, uh, a wrong interpretation 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 of, 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 of the, the candle. The, the menorah, man. The menorah is not to be like that. But my point is the this one. See? This is what I call the UFO. This is not a UFO. This is the, the chariot of Yahweh. The, the angels are in there. So that's why at night you see them move around and they call it the UFO. No. These will come and take over this earth, man. This one will come and save us. When you read uh, Luke, I believe 28 or something like that. Uh, uh, even Matthew. 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 No, Matthew 24 and 31. It tells you that the angel will go all over the place and take the elect. And we do the work because we, we know what's coming on and we pray to be part of the elect. Because when the destruction comes, there is a destruction that will come, man. We will be part, we will be saved, man. Yo, madam, is it funny? Huh? Is it funny? Yeah, it's funny. All right, man. Let it, let it be funny for now. No, 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 cool. No, I'm just saying. Let it be funny for now. Come very silly won't be funny, man. That's right, that's right. Hey, that's right. the best laugh is the last laugh, man. That's right, that's right. They're laughing right now, but we're going to laugh. That's right. We're going to be drinking our wine and laughing while they're being destroyed. Man. That's right. That's All right? right, so this is it, what I was talking about. This is the, the chariot. And they're playing movies and things like that. Do you think they don't know the truth? Hollywood know the truth. Hollywood had like um, a partnership with the CIA to make sure that no, they don't bring information like that. So what they do instead, they bring, bring it subliminally. That's why you have that, that movie called, um, what's that movie, your Will Smith? Um, I Am a Legend? No, 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 there's another one. Uh, I Robot? Independence Day. Independence Day, oh yeah, it's It's all in the Bible, man. Yeah. All right, so yeah. So this is what's going on, man. So let's read it now. Let's carry your for this. There's more meat into that, that thing, man. There's more meat, man. But thanks for, for listening, you know. Yeah. The most I know what it's doing, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Car, exactly. This is Sarah. Car, car, car. Do, you, do you have a YouTube? Me? Yeah. yeah. You don't have YouTube on the phone? Yeah, I do have YouTube. Yeah, yeah, bring your YouTube. I will, I will give you my channel. Yeah. In the YouTube, I'll, I will give you my channel. So when you, when you got time, you will subscribe. And when you got time, you can just watch it, man. Because even what that conversation will be on it, you know, as well. So, yeah, let me, let me find it. I got YouTube right there. Yeah. You know? Uh, and I will try. So the name of Je it's not Jesus, it's Yahweh. No, 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 but it's okay to drink alcohol, you know. Yeah? It's okay to drink alcohol. You know? <laughs> it's in the Bible. I'll show you. 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 Don't worry. Yeah, don't worry about that. Yeah, so that's my channel here. That's us teaching, yeah. So when the time comes, you can watch it. So carry on, my Carry it. This is the book of Surat. Chapter 23, right. starting at verse 19. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I know what you say when you say Jesus is a party man and alcohol. I know what you're saying. She goes, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, no, no, that's bad. That's 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 done. That's that's an abomination. The Bible says in Leviticus 20 and 13 that a man shouldn't lie with a man. So you're right. Yes. No, that's just that's 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 wrong. That's abomination. Oh, yes, okay. That's fine. Yeah, don't worry. Right. Okay, so right. Chapter 23, starting at 19. Mm -hmm. Such a man only feareth the eyes of men, yeah. and knoweth not that the eyes of Yahweh mm -hmm. are 10,000 times brighter than the sun, right. beholding all the ways of men. Beholding all the ways of men, yeah. Considering the most secret parts. You see that? So the most I see is it all, man. Carry on. He knew all things uh, right. ever mm -hmm. they were created. Right. So also after they were perfected, right. he looked upon them all. See that? This man shall be punished in the streets of the city. You see that? And so when, when you see a lot of people that died and fought, like they get shot in the, because they did so much wickedness that the, term, the, the judgment was pronounced in the heavenly and it manifests the, the angel I, came I and, and do it. Sometimes it's not all about them, it's a tradition thing like you, you like your mighty brother or whatever and they just come back and you cast your side right. No, no, but, it, but, but at the same, but yeah, I know, but at the end of the day, it's judgment. 
You gotta understand, judgment takes place in the heavenlies and manifest the angel are the one that go out there and bring the judgment. But read it, my lad. It says, hey, Salah, it says, this man shall, uh, Surah 23 and 21, mm -hmm. this man shall be punished in the streets of the city, yeah. and where he suspecteth not, he shall be taken. You see that? That's why you say, when you come, you don't see it. That's why they're going to be sitting there, and people come, bah, 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 bah. they don't see it coming, because this angel are swift, man. The angel are very, they bring judgment swiftly. Yeah, read it. Vengeance. Yeah. Verse 22. Uh huh. It says, Thus shall it go also mm -hmm. with the wife that leaveth her husband. You see that? So all these women that are doing this dirt, demand them. They will pay for it. Carry on. And bringeth in an ear by another. You see, so you got women that they get pregnant, you think that's your children, but they're not your children. A lot of that happening right now. They're, they're, they're going to get a judgment too. A lot of our sisters do that. Read it. And bringing this an ear by another. Yeah. It says, um, it's a lot. Uh, Verse 23, uh -huh. for first, uh -huh. she hath disobeyed the law of the Most High. You see that? So that's, that's against the law. Carry on. And secondly, she hath trespassed against her own husband. Right. So she dis dis her husband by going out, you know, and uh, having sex with a man. And thirdly, you know? she hath played the whore in adultery and brought children by another man. Right. Michelle, I'm, doing, I'm, I'm, I'm teaching right now. Look, I'm teaching. I will call you in a bit. Levi, I'm teaching right now, I'll call you in a bit, yeah? Yeah, my lad, come on. And brought, for, and brought the children by another man. You see that? That happened all the time. Your carrier? It says, verse 24, uh -huh. She shall be brought out into the congregation, see that? Mm -hmm. and inquisition shall be made of her children. So a lot of women will die. A lot, of, a lot of women, judgment is coming because our people are doing things in the dark and in secret and they think that they will get away with it. They're not going to get away. You will see that a lot of our people will start dying. People will be like, people, you will, see, you will hear things, you will hear things happening you won't know why. No, the most I decided to judge, man. You understand that? Carry on. Carrying on reading, it says, for uh, verse 24, she shall be brought out into the congregation and right. inquisition shall be made of her children. Right. Her children shall not take root uh -huh. and her, her branches shall bring forth no fruit. You see that? She shall leave her... So a lot of people are born in vain. A lot of people are born in vain. There's children that have been born just for judgment right now. It's crazy, man. People don't, our people don't fear the Most High, but the Most High has to bring judgment because the name Yahweh, remember, and the, the name Yahweh, try. There's a time of when you come, people be trembling. Right now, when you say Yahweh, Yahweh says, Who that know Jesus? In Jesus' name, I pray. In Jesus, they don't respect it. They don't understand Yahweh child. They think it's Jesus. Mommy, isn't it? You think it's Jesus, isn't it? Yes. Amen. You see that? Huh? The most I can't pray. <laughs> it's going to be a, a wake up. Man, it's a wake up call, man. Reality check is coming, man. Look at our people, man. She said, hey, Amen. <laughs> The pastors, the pastors are the ones that are destroying our people, man. And the most are going to destroy these pastors. They're living lav lavishly, thinking that it's, they're thinking that it's, 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 they're, they're, they're on top of judgment. See these people here? Yeah? They think they're on top of judgment because nothing's happened. Let me tell you something. When you suffer on earth and you're, and you're good in your heart, because the most I loves you. Because gold is refined by fire. That's what I was saying. The realest people get the hardest fight because they're good in the heart, but the most is refining them for the future. Right. Exactly. Because in order for you to prosper in this fucking society, you gotta be wicked. You gotta, you gotta bow down to the what? The beast and do what they're doing, and that's how you get money. But people that are righteous, they're catching the most hell. You see that? Yeah. This is the book of Zechariah. Bring that out, my lad. Chapter 13, mm -hmm. starting at verse 2. 
and it shall come to pass in that day, saith Yahweh of hosts, that I will cut off the names of the idols out of the land. See that? So the most I will cut off the name of the idol out of the land. It's coming, man. All these idol worshippers, those wicked people that are not following the law of the Most High, thinking they can do what they want, the Most High won't bring judgment, man. And one of the names of the idols is Jesus. Man. Yes, it's Jesus. You know that Jesus name is the devil. The Bible speaks That's of. That's right. Man. It says, and they shall no more be remembered. Right. You and, see, and they shall no more. All these great people that you see, these politicians, no more remember them in the kingdom. You know. That's right. No one remember all these people that we see, these big names. They're gonna be at the bottom. That's right. Hey, the Bible say the last shall be the f be first, and the first shall be last, man. Eh? And also, I will cause the prophets and the unclean spirits to pass out of the land. You see that all those fake prophets, prophet D.D. Jakes, prophet, all of those fake pastors, man. They got it coming for, and, and, you know, the most is bringing the judgment, man. They got it coming. Verse you know? 3, and it shall come to pass. All these Jay-Z's and those fake people that they put on, on top to control our people, to brainwash our people, their judgment is coming. They ain't gonna, you ain't gonna be, no one can escape their judgment. And it no one. And it shall come to pass, when any shall yet prophesy, right? then his father and his mother, uh -huh. that began him, shall say unto him, uh -huh. Thou shall not live. You see that? For thou speakest lies in the name of the Lord. Right. So these pastors are speaking lies in the name of the Lord, man. All you women that like to go to this pastor, that love the pastor, but they dress well. They're liars, they're snakes, you know. He says, That's and money, money and, uh, and, and scam. You know, they're scammers, man. They're the original scammers. People want to talk about. Yeah, they're, they're false prophets. They don't, they don't teach the people. Mark, go to, uh, when you finish that, go to Malachi 2 and 7. I will show you that they're false prophets. Uh, this is how you know a real, a, a real prophet. When you finish that, go to Malachi 2 and 7. And his father and his mother that begat him shall right? trust him through when he prophesies. And it shall come to pass in that day that the prophets shall be ashamed. You see that? That will, be, that will, that will look like that. That will look like that, man. That will be ashamed because the most I will bring them naked. They will be naked, man. Everyone. Will, you know how in West Africa, when, when, it, when a thief, they catch a thief, they, 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 they take his, his clothes off. It's, it means shame. Ooh. That the prophet shall be ashamed, every one of his vision, see that? when he has prophesied, Neither shall he wear a rough garment to the sea. You see what I mean? Take so the most I'm gonna take his clothes off, man. Right. Take them clothes off, man. That's, right. That's what's gonna happen to this fake pastor. But I think it's a joke right now when we speak. Because at this point it just only talk. But you gotta understand, you Jamaican say, I'm done talking. Me done talking. Hey, Yahweh, Yahweh is almost done talking. Done talking, man. Yahweh Shah is almost done talking, man. That's why they're gonna feel the wrath because that thing is a joke right now. You got it? This, this is how you know a good prophet. Arya? Malachi 2 and 14? Three. Or 3 and 14? Three, uh, 2 and 7. Okay, this is the book of Malachi, chapters 2. I'm gonna start at verse 7. Bring that out. It says, For the priest's lips should keep knowledge. For the priest's lips should keep knowledge. Meaning, a priest will always be about knowledge. A priest will give the understanding of who God is, of who his son is, or how to please the Most High. You know, how to have faith in his son. You know? Carry on. And they should seek the law. And they should mouth. seek the law at his mouth. So we're going to show you how to keep the law, how to please the law. We're going to tell you don't eat pork, don't eat prawns. We're going to tell you to keep the Sabbath. Okay? We're going to tell you don't have sex with someone else's wife. Don't have sex with a woman when she when she in a period, you know, so on and so forth, man. Don't kill a man, okay? Don't you have to love your neighbor? You know, simple. The law, hey, the law of the Most High not, is not grievous, man. His laws are not grievous. You know what I mean? They want to do what they want to do. You know why? Because they want to satisfy the flesh. That's why Paul say, mortify your members. One of the one of the fight is to learn how to let your spirit take over your flesh. Because your flesh will always ask you to do certain things that are against, are contrary to the law. But the fight between the flesh and the spirit is constant, man. But the law allow you or teach you how to fight against your flesh. And your flesh is your worst enemy, man. You see what I'm saying? Your flesh is your worst enemy. Precept and now. And now. This is the book of Deuteronomy, mm -hmm. chapter 18 and verse 20. Bring that out. But uh, it's King James. It says, 
but the prophets mm -hmm. which shall presume to speak right. a word in my name right. which I have not commanded him uh -huh. to speak right. or that shall speak in the name of other gods even that prophet shall die bring that up and break it down too so basically if there's a prophet out there that is not using the name of Yahweh Shimei Shai, yeah, yeah. all right and basically not speaking according to this 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 word ultimately the bible says that they're gonna die but verse 21 says and if thou say in thy heart how shall we know the words which the lord have spoken uh, uh, which the lord have not spoken so basically how are we gonna know you know to able to identify who's a real prophet and who's uh, 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 a fake prophet a false hey, prophet hey, how you doing you right you okay so, you love you love the word isn't it you're, you see that's what the most i say we should come and go see them you see how she wants because she's pure she's clean she want to look Oh, it's like yeah, it's like yeah. Because he's pure, he's so cute, you know. Because he's pure and he's clean, so he loves that purity. Yes. Bye bye, take care. Ah! That's a that's a future prophet right there, man. You see, the Mosa is, is raising the prophet, man. Elijah, yeah. Elijah. You know, you see, prophet Elijah. Like his name Elijah. You see that? It's, that's the reason why he loved the word because his name bear witness, man. Verse yeah. 22. When yeah, the prophet Israelite, speaketh right? in the name of Yahweh, because that's us. That's we are the children of the. This is what the word is. We. This is what we used to do before. Now this evil got us doing other things. No, that's what we do, man. We about the truth, man. He says, okay? when a prophet speaketh in the name of Yahweh, if the thing followed not, no come to pass. Yeah. Then, it's like a, then, it's like a, That is the thing which the Lord have not spoken, but the prophet have spoken it presumptuously. Thou shalt not be afraid of him. See that? So exactly. So these pastors, why are they saying a prophecy that came to pass? They don't even prophesy. They don't even talk about what's going on right now. All they talk about, you're going to make money. You can be rich. You can make this. Your blessing is coming. Your favor. Yeah, don't quote it, but this is what I'm trying to say. Right, about money. Yeah. You understand what I'm trying to say to you? That's what they're doing. Uh, look though, be a civilizer now, yeah. Yeah. You've been sent by the more side. You Calm. could have some paper throw down a child look money. You're not doing that. Calm. It's just a message. You know what I'm saying? Calm. It's just a message you're Calm. sending. You see what I mean? Calm. You could have some plate here. A throw down on people and try to make some money. Calm. Uh, yeah. Calm. I know that you're on. You understand what I'm saying? Calm. This is what this is from a place. Please let me say about money. Yeah. Because this society is set yeah. up like that. You know, people think that to be when you're happy, more money. But hey, biggest, uh, biggest uh, rock, rock about more money, more problem, man. Yeah, what he's even, he's even, he's even more of a prophet than he's. At least he, at least he's from the truth. They make you believe that money is the blessing. I mean, money is a good defense, but it's not the ultimate thing. Right. If they're working with them, then I carry to them and I work against them. So them trying to be hypocritical, you know what I'm saying? They're trying to be hypocritical role, you get what I'm saying? Of course, yeah. that's what it is. Because they know the right thing and they're not doing the right thing. Right, because they are forced. Like for example, charity, when you go to church, you go to charity, they give you money. Your, your tax exempt, they give you money, all of that. You benefit from lying. You benefit That's from true. not telling the people the truth, man. That's how wicked this system is, bro. Okay, you get it, you get it. You understand that? So we know about it. That's why we're out here. And we want to let them know that you're not going to avoid just a judgment. We want to let them know that England will be destroyed. We want to let them know that, the man. They get away with it, but all oh, man. For how long are you gonna get? Because the Mosa is coming, man. The time is coming. So repent Israel, man. But with that, man, hopefully you were edified. Alright? We done, man. My brother yeah. was a blessing. Yeah, you know, what's your name? See, yeah. hey, my name is Yara, yeah? Yeah, man. Be I said love, man. Just hey, keep love, yeah? Alright, right, man. Yeah. So I'll give you the channel. Yeah, man. Look yeah, it up, yeah? One more time inside All right, because really run through and you know what I mean? One love, yeah? One love, my bro. Yeah, yeah man. So, bro, just say some whatever you want to say yeah so um yeah man it's time for our people to wake up but clearly as you can see the most high has um a lot of people on his hit list man because majority of the two-thirds is most of the nation man 
fruit. All right, one third is less in number than two thirds. So majority of our people are going to be destroyed by Yahweh Shem Yahushai right. because they don't want to repent and they refuse to hearken. And ultimately, like the brother said, the Most High has put the spirit of slumber on them to where they're not going to receive this word, man. Only an elective can receive this word. And also, as well, uh, when it comes to our people, you know, the only time they're going to wake up is when the cities are wasted, man. So, hey, you know, that's why, you know, the brother said, we, we ain't going to be doing videos for six hours, three oh, hours. Oh, man, right now, the most we're doing is one hour and, and much. Hey, the time of, don't, hey, I'm, and that's the thing, all these prophets, you got to grow, man. You can't be going and doing, you, when you go out there for six hours, what, how many people do you get? <laughs> no, who's going to, you think, you think, you think, Jake, when you go on TikTok, the most, the longest TikTok thing is out of 30 seconds. Yeah. People, you want 30 second clip, 30 second clip. This is how people are entertaining yeah. themselves on YouTube. Yeah. And you want to make a channel, you want to make a, 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 a lesson for six hours. You're mad. You want to go out every time. What are you doing? Look, take time to, to take care of yourself. All right. To, 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 to put into, uh, apply what you, you'll be teaching. This is the time. We have to apply now what we've been teaching for so many years. You have to apply it. You have to go into the depth of this Bible so we can, we can it's like a, the Bible is like gold. You gotta, you gotta go into it and get it so you can become gold yourself. Apply unity, apply love, you know? Apply understanding now the layers that is hidden, okay? I'll give you one example, man. I'll give you one example that people don't even know. We talk about the Red Sea. The Red Sea, if you go into the etymology, you check it, it's actually the Sea of Reed. R E E D, go and check it. It wasn't an ocean, it was a, it was a sea, it was like a, a big river of reed that her people trust, man. Study, study. Just don't just, you know, babble along and, you know, I'm in Israel, I'm going to do the work and I say, no, these people ain't gonna get it. It's for only a select few, man. So stop making those long videos, man. You wanna be seen or what? You wanna be seen. Saying, man, you know, even the elders of Great Millstone, they don't do uh, long videos, man. Because Just go to the point. That's it, man. This is it, man. There's no, what else do you want to hear us say, man? We've said everything. We've been out there. We did the work, man. Yeah. People are not listening. What else do they want to hear us say? They want to hear us. You know what I mean? Say what else? Say well, yeah, man. With that, we're gonna turn to the east, man. And we're gonna give our praises. Yahweh, Bashir, Yahushai, Wahab, Rachel, Kadash. Go on, man. Abad Babo, man. Shalom, Israel. Oh. That he sent and signified it by his angel and unto his servant John. So I'm going to go to verse.